All right, we're starting a new game today. It's called King's Way. And it is highly recommended by our boy, uh, <laughs> The Is. I've been calling him Easy forever, but he's The Is, all of The Is. Uh, also known as Rainy Street to all the Pub G fans. He's a real MVP. He's a real, real baller. And I'm excited to share this game. Uh, so far, I don't have any game audio. I don't know if that's on purpose or not. All right, I'm a new adventurer. So this is a, uh, a custom operating system. Enter name. Hein. All right, choose class. Uh, beast skin. Rogue Moyer. I'm going to go mage. Uh, everyone gets the same world generated once per day. No, I don't want to do that because it's my first time playing. I don't know how to do this game, so edit. Nah, man, that dude looks bad. A, hey, he's got like a star over his face. All right, accept. Choose a starting gift. I'm going with extra magic points. Oh, we got audio. Oh, 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 girl. Double click the world navigator to travel through the land of King's Way. Alright, we got a log of what we're going to be doing here. Status effects, health effects, speed paused, volume, quest. Oh, this is fantastic. This is, this is really good. I can already tell this is like really good. Oh, that's right here. Oh, that kills it. Kills it. Uh, it looks like the time zone. Never mind. I think that's for the game. All right, let's pull this back up. Status log. Info. Glossary. Poisoned. Burned. Starting gift manner. Uh, take damage over time. Does not go away. Take more damage from physical attacks. Goes away over time. Starting gift. Blah, blah, blah. Let's close that. All right. Uh, looks like I've got a broken sword. It's no good. And a dirty shirt. Well, I'm a wizard anyway, so. What's this? Skills. Burn, poison, chill, hill, critical focus, and vigilance. Select a skill to see its description. Well, burn is fire. Poison is poison. Chill, I'm guessing, has an ice attack. Inflict full cold damage and slow target. Critical focus. Changes to a critical plus 4%. So... I wonder if this is a passive skill. I just have a 4% chance to crit. Vigilance. At the start of every battle, you, your first attack is 40% faster. Oh, that's fantastic. All right, let's let's uh, let's go into... Oh, we can play some music. This needs a, its own audio bar. It's a little loud. All right, World Navigator. The yellow circles on the map are map nodes. Click a node to travel to its location or inspect it for more information. So I can inspect it. Distance 112 it says location boat. Oh, we're on a boat. It says name training room, I guess. It says training R dot 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 dot. Uh, can we maximize any of this stuff? All right. There is a battle dummy. Some location have events that trigger when you arrive. You must deal with the event before you can continue traveling. Oh, what up, Cookie? I saw your call. I had just started, man. Just started. I was going to talk to you about North Korea. It's just kind of crazy. Some of the stuff that happened today. But uh, I'll let you later, man. Uh, good to see you though. You should stick around, man. This game's cool. You can tell me how your day is and stuff if you want, but I'm mostly going to, you know, focus on the game some. Uh, but this is a weird game. It's like an old school operating system, like Windows 3.1, but it's a game. Alright, when a battle 
When in a battle, you can choose an available skill. Each skill has a special use, and some are faster than others. Press the sword skill to attack your target. You're not my dad. You can't tell me what to do. Oh, we hit it for two damage. The dummy. This is like a text-based. This is like the T T two T. You have to like keep clicking. All right. So mm -hmm. can we loot? No, no loot found. You encounter battles while traveling as well as as in events. If you encounter an enemy too powerful, you can try to escape. All right. So I guess we're gonna click to there. This is a supplies chest. There's a sign next to the chest that reads, one free potion per adventurer. Alright, so we just got a potion. Um, we're supposed to look in our bag. So We'll get all these different windows set up. Can we drag from there to there? Alright, so we got a potion. Uh, it heals 30% health. Do not want to quite use that. We also have... The King's Summons, the old tale stories of the shifting land, when one day the sun won't rise, but instead an eternal being will travel over the land, closing the sky with its unthinkable signs, its footprints distort the ground. Those few who survive will no longer recognize the land, and history will begin anew. Every era, the people of the land seek a savior to end this cycle of destruction, brought on by the Eternal One, which some call the Sky Eater. Ancient prophecy predicts an outsider will come to the king's land only days before the reckoning and gain the power to destroy the Sky Eater. Travel to the king's castle to the east to prove yourself the worthy savior of the land. It's kind of self-righteous. Uh, we have a random key. It opens simple locks. continue return to surface this is the king's land the king's castle is to the east but be careful quick traveling to the east too quickly there are powerful monsters closer to the king's castle so take your time to get some experience that way all right this is a fort <clears throat> fort brack mac it has an end, potion shop, armor, magic, travel, and a guild. New miss, new message from the Adventurer Corp. Welcome to Kingsway. I wish we could make these bigger. Uh, we are here at Adventure Corp. We're here to guide you on your pilgrimage to the King's Castle. The first thing you want to do is get acquainted with the guild. The guild is an organization that employs outsiders like yourself to do various tasks around the land. Uh, the rewards will be essential to your journey. Bring them the letter that brought you here and they will take it from there. You can find guild outposts at any fort and in some small villages. All right, requirement, king summons. They're gonna give us a sleeping bag. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go. All right, so here we are. You can go to the inn, armor shop, potion shop, magic shop, traveler, guild. Clearly, we need to go to the guild uh, quests. Orientation. All right, we're going to submit orientation. All right, we just got a supplies bag. Supplies! So we have a bag in a bag. Uh, Ballin? That almost seems a little buggy, so I think um, I'm going to keep that as is. Alright, um, select a quest to abandon back. Storage. We can store things at the guild. Alright, this is my person. I'm going to assume I can drag this key. 
Oh yeah, strength just went to four. All right, here we go. Let's get all this rolled up. All right, I want to get all these windows fixed. Okay, there's an inn, a potion shop, a magic shop, armor shop, or travel. Uh, anything we think we should go look at? I'm going to check out maybe the inn. Rest and recover health for eight gold? No. No, let's just go travel? Maybe. How much money do we have? Okay, it says we have 40 gold over here. Um... Required level two. Is everything going to cost like a level? We could buy a farm hat. Should we buy the farm hat? Yeah, let's. We're going to buy a hat. And uh, we don't have any pants. But it doesn't have a pants slot. So we're going to assume that we always have pants on. Which is maybe dumb. Okay, I don't think I bought that hat correctly. I don't know if I bought the shoes correctly. Plus two travel distance. Okay. And then a shield is for level two. So let's just buy the level one stuff. All right, we got our fancy shoes on. We got our fancy hat. All right, let's go on an adventure. Wait a minute. I'm supposed to be a wizard. Oh, I think I made a mistake. I should have bought the wooden wand. I have $30. I have $30 and I need four. You know what? We're going to be we're going to be an epic Epic wizard that doesn't even need a staff. How about that? Unburied appears. Alright, we beat him. Let's see if we got any loot. Nothing found. You come across another wanderer on the, your path. Sitting on a rock, they look scared. Oh, don't be scared. The wanderer appears to be injured and asks for your help. The wonder gains strength and thanks you. Alright, looks like he's giving us a book. The Book of uh, Astral Flare. Uh, we need 8 intelligence, which uh, isn't uh, too far away from what we have. Permanently learn the skill Astral Flare, which is what exactly? Nobody knows. The wonder thanks you again gives you a treasure. Let's talk rumors. The Wanderer says those eerie monoliths showed up a few days ago. I wonder if they're here to help. I hear they react when you give them a magical item. Oh, is that it? I couldn't talk to him again? Well, alrighty then. Um, let's keep traveling. Somehow we got one gold. Alright. Um... All right, we're in a battle. I don't know what's moving around. Oh, she hit me. She's she's angry. Oh, she threw a... I'm poisoned! All right, we leveled up. Health increased, magic increased, defense increased. Three stat skills plus one skill point. All right, let's learn burn. I want to be a fire mage. Um, I think we did good. She has a skull on her. It says someone may want the skull. Okay. Potion of magic recovers 50% of our magic. Well, we actually haven't been using any of our magic really, but. You come across a derelict house. Do you enter? Of course we enter. We're adventurers. 
You say the entrance of the derelict house. There are several rooms. Where do you go? The nursery. You enter the nursery. Do you hear a noise? I, I don't know. Did I? Right, let's go um. to the study. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Found a mushroom. Oh, there's another mushroom. We got jumped. We got jumped by two mushrooms. All right, we just got some seeds. Oh, my bad. Thanks, Chaos. Oh, crap. My bad on the title. This game's kind of weird. I mean, I like it. I don't know how well it's going to translate to you guys because of all the other little windows. A lot of you guys watch watch on your phones or tablets and I think it's going to be kind of hard to see. But the game the game actually is right up my alley. It's 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 actually pretty entertaining. Okay, Kings Way. Alright. Alright, Demon Killer. It's all good, man. Alright, I updated the stream information. Thanks, Chaos, for the uh the shout on that. Inkbot just rolled in as well, so Okay. Looted the first mushroom. I don't know if we're supposed to collect these seeds or not, but I guess I'm going to do it. You enter the study, everything is covered in dust. There's a monster. Yeah, we already fought him. Oh, I also need to up my intelligence to eight. And let's get uh, this vitality. What does that even mean? Increase maximum health points. Sure. All right, um, I think I'm going to move some of these windows around a little bit. I want my status bar. Okay. We've gone to the nursery, the study. Let's try the bedroom. Uh, you enter the bedroom. It smells like rot. There's a locked chest. Well, I'm going to unlock it. Oh, just used one of my keys. Better be worth it. All right. We just got an oak staff. All right. So you can't use this item yet. Learn to skill burn. Okay. Leather armor. Eight defense. Oh, required level four. So we're just going to have to hold on to that. Uh, we need to be level three for the oak staff. Dang it. All right, well, we'll get our broken sword back. Womp, womp. All right, let's rest in the bed. All right, we got a message from the Adventure Corp. Hurry, limited time offer. Travel, we, we, want, <clears throat> we want to do our part to help all the adventurers trying to save the land from the coming apocalypse. To that, we're giving out free points. Offer available until 2 p.m. while supplies last. Limit one per... Uh, adventure, a location star has been added to the World Navigator. It's 10.32 in the game. It's 10.32. We better go to the dining room real quick, which there was nothing there. Okay. We need to get to that star on the map. Go, man, go. Uh-oh. Skelly Tan. He had no loot on him. Uh, 
We're so close to the star. I think we're going to make it in time. I think we're going to make it. Oh, God. We might... I might... I might die. Can I run away? Escape. 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 Oh, God. We're going to die. Oh, rip! Hind the Wanderer, level 2 mage, killed by poison. Oh, no. Maybe you should have tried to panic, use a potion? Oh, man. Alright, new adventure. Enter name. Alright, we're going to name this character after Cookie. All right, cookie, choose class. We're going to go beast kin. He's a beast kin. Edit portrait. Oh, that looks like him. All right, choose a starting gift. Six health, two magic, or 20 gold. We're going to give him extra health. Cookie, don't let us down, dude. Don't let us down. Uh oh, I think my chat just goofed. There we go. That's better. Oh, that's better. All right. Um, this is different. This is not how it was last time. Oh, this is cool. Every time it's different. Okay. There's a hooded figure in the distance. They look scared. Oh, Cookie, approach him. The hooded figure appears to be injured and asks for your help. Give potion. The hooded figure gains strength and thanks you. The hooded figure thanks you again and gives you 14 gold. Give me advice. Uh, the hooded figure says, I'm just traveling to regenerate my magic energy. Alright, we need to go to the guild. Turn in this I think this time I'm gonna put all of the stuff in my bag can I sell the supplies bag you have a heavy ring of purity 18% uh, poison resistance way to go cookie uh, looks like you've got a potion of magic and a potion of healing so in case you get in a bind I'm not going to let you die. Not like I died, at least. Uh, okay, so back up, back up. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. You've got 54 gold. You're a beastkin. Now what exactly do beastkins... When the church decided it needed its own army, it raised the dead from the ground to protect its walls. Really, church? This is a game by Adult Swim Games. Nice. I don't really, I don't really know. I don't really know what a beast. Oh, dude, I think you're some kind of, like, dark wizard. You're going to give people the evil eye. Which I can't do yet, actually. I don't even know. What does a beast can really do? Nobody knows. Alright, we got some towns coming up. Let's just, let's just travel. I forgot to buy you a sword, though. 
You come across an abandoned hovel. Do you enter it? You stand at the entrance of the abandoned hovel. There are several rooms. You're going to go straight to the attic. You enter the attic. The ceiling is sagging. There's a locked chest. Unlock it. Open it. Bro, you just got you an axe. Required strength nine. Well, I guess we know what we're going to be leveling up. All right, let's see if you can get these shoes. Yeah, you can wear these shoes. All right, you're wearing some shoes. GG. Oh, God. Oh, God, there's already a spider trying to kill you. All right, you leveled up. You're just as good as I am. Permanently weakens target enemy, causing them to take one more damage from every attack. I kind of want you to have evil eye. We're going to learn evil eye. If there's another skill that you see that you want to learn later, just, just holler at your boy. Oh, speaking of beast eyes, you just got a beast eye. Someone may want this. Who? Who would want that? Alright, you just got uh, 8 strength. You need 9. Oh, I thought it was 8. I thought it was 8. Nothing in the storeroom. Nothing in the side room. Oh, it's another spider. I. How do you do spells? Oh, you just cast an evil eye. Oh, you just did four damage. Oh, that evil eye is pro. So pro. Nothing found. Oh, no. Oh, no, another spider. Luckily, you've got a ton of health. Dude, evil eye is the way to go. Who would have known? You come across another abandoned house. We always go attic first. And of course, there's always a spider. Man. These beasts, they want your cookies. The end of the nursery, the floor is full of holes. There's a locked chest. Unlock the chest, open chest. What is this? Cruel leather armor of agility. It also looks like a dress. Required level 5. 16% damage to beasts, which might be bad. I think... I don't even know. And then you can get an oak staff. Uh, but you're not smart enough to know how to use staff, so... Probably sell that at some kind of store. You know, the hall, there's nothing in the hall. We go in the side room, there's nothing in the side room. Alright, we need to go to this this town all right enter the town bad news this town is not a town it's a dungeon oh dear baby Jesus mistakes were made there's a strange figure on your path shut up there's a strange figure on you shut up there's a strange figure on your path. It's carrying a small bag of overflowing with shiny objects. The figure is very focused, investigating every crevice of a nearby wall. Uh, let's let's say hello to him. With a closer look, you can see that the strange figure is some sort of demon-like creature. It notices you and tries to hide behind its bag. Let's talk to him. I'll let you look at my items if you promise not to hurt me. Deal. The demon thanks you for sparing me. I'll let you look at these most wondrous objects I have found and maybe even sell you one. Just one. Um, he's got some good stuff here. Hardy Slipperies of Fury. That sounds amazing. Mighty Buckler of Warding. Um, I'm kind of interested... In the buckler, but let's look at the the circlet. It won't let me. All right, we're gonna purchase this buckler. Good luck. The demon gives you the item and scurries away. 
We can't use this item yet. Surprise, surprise. Uh, we need to be level 5. Well, until we get to level 5, I'm still going to quote-unquote have it equipped. Uh, just because, why not? Uh, we're really close to level 3. I just don't want to die. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh shisa. How do I use this potion? I just got burned. Hit him. Hit him. Oh my god, we leveled up. When you level up your your uh your health maxes back out. Thank Jesus. All right, so we already knew evil eye. Um I think we need to learn the leech spell, which is actually going to give us health from our enemies. So let's learn leech. Um, I don't know what that means exactly. Oh yeah, I do. What up, Candy? All right, and he also had an orb. Required intelligence eight. Well, we're not playing an intellectual character. No, no, I wasn't ready. Oh, I missed the arrow. All right, strength. What up, banana? What up, dude? All right. All right, Cookie now has an axe. We now have an axe. There's two chests. We don't have any keys. What does this orb do? It's plus one damage. Where would you put the orb? Is that like an item? Uh, I feel like we might need to be a little bit more agile. My chat is being really goofy. You beat the first DLC for The Witcher? Now for the long one. Well, I'm playing Kingsway. And uh, I like it. it kind of reminds me of Castle of the Wind, but I mean, not really. It's just it's an old roguelike adventure with a crazy operating system. Um, I don't have any keys, but I still want to travel to this. Oh, oh god. come across a radiant treasure chest man there's all kinds of stupidity for like wizards and stuff plus three movement speed plus three travel distance what's the difference what's the difference crescent potion grants one stat po point yeah, okay, we're going to do strength and maximum health points. Uh, did not give me health. I was hoping it would. Red boots plus four travel distance. All right, so we're going to go at least the blue ones. I'm taking all this stuff that I can in case I ever make it to uh, a city. I can sell it. All right, we now have the ruined armor of flight plus two agility plus five percent escape chance. Rip dirty shirt. All right, we also have a robe now. Um, plus fifteen percent magical power. We're really not that magical. I mean, we're we're gonna take it, right? But uh, all right, I kind of want to go there. I'm so scared I'm gonna die. Oh, there's a message down here. The king's castle. Hello, Cookie. Making your way to the King's Castle won't be an easy task. Uh, there are three beacons that first must be lit. All right, we'll read that quest later. All right, let's go to this chest. You come across the treasure chest. Let's open it. All right, it's got a way crystal. Crush this to get outside quickly. Do not eat it cookie do not eat it another oak staff another orb wait what level do i need to be for the orb 
Oh, it's not level. It has to do with my intelligence. Look. My bag is too full for the orb. Oh. Stupid dirty shirt. Let's throw that away. How heavy is this orb? It needs to have weight on here. It needs to have how heavy it is. Alright, well. Let's get rid of the broken sword then. Oh, I think I already... I think I already lost that chest. Oh, well. Alright, whatever. Whatever. Does that skull mean I'm a big boss and I'm gonna kill you? Oh, God. Oh, this could be it. This could be it for our friend Cookie. Oh, so close. He's got 10 HP. A corrupted ring of sense. Minus one regeneration. Uh, I mean, we'll, we'll try to sell that, but... What is that table? What is it? I'm really nervous. Oh god, no. Your health is critically low. I'm... Oh, rip! Cookie the Wanderer got to level 3. He was killed by a church guard. Uh, he... He... He lived longer than I did. Oh, sweet cookie. Can we, like, continue with the same... Select an adventure to begin? Can you really use the same adventure again? No, that's not how we roll. We're using followers. We're using followers. All right. This dude looks like silence. All right, silence is going to be a warrior... And we're going to give him 20 gold to start. Alright. He's got the same orientation that all of them do. Blah, 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 blah. I always throw the log down here. Let's throw that there. Get this new message off of there. Go away. Alright, let's open up his character. Throw that up there. And uh, open his purse. His purse is there. Alright, we're going to get better at this. Okay. Alright, let's go... Let's go adventure, like, down to up, and then we can maybe heal at the city. Come across a house. Um, let's go down to the basement. You enter the basement, it smells like rot. Alright, library? Let's check the bookshelves. There is a scroll of chill. Uh, let's use it? No, 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 no. It's a scroll. Alright, let's go to the kitchen. There's a chest here. We'll use our only key. There is a spear. We need to be level 3 to use it, but that's cool. And then a shield that we'll use at level 2. Now, I want to put it there, even though it says we can't use it. I want to see if it will automatically equip at level 2. Oh god, there's a, there's a spider. Alright, we got him. We got him! When the Sky Eater sheds its feathers... Over the land, sometimes creatures are impaled by them and transformed into beasts. It's terrifying. Alright, beast's eye. Hopefully we can sell that at a store. Uh, we did find a bed to rest in. Nice. I already like this house because we can heal here. I wonder if like, if we went down here we could go back and use that bed again. I'm going to try it. Skelly Tan. Oh, we crushed him. I think Chaos's character is going to be OP. 
You come across an abandoned house. It's got another bedroom. It's got a chest, but we don't have a key. That's a bummer. Alright, we enter the library. Unintelligible writing is carved on the wall. There's paper with strange symbols drawn on it. Alright, let's take the paper. It's got a monolith. Uh, it's got a, uh, a black Polaroid, a monolith. It doesn't like water, and then it likes sunlight. All right, we're gonna we're gonna take this, and we're gonna check the books. Another scroll of chill. I need to re remember to use my scrolls. All right, how do I use this? Use it. All right, we just used a, the scroll of chill. It did four damage to that guy. All right, so if we have anybody that's really difficult, we probably want to use the scroll of chill. He had a key. He's got a ruined piece of armor. Uh, level 2, so we'll use that and almost level 2, we're almost level 2. Alright, rest in the bed. Alright, so Chaos is like full health. Ever heard of ghost caps? They're a type of mushroom which grows in caves. They get their name from the way they w will make you dead if you eat them. However, if you know how to cut them and season them just right there, a delicious snack. So they'll, they'll kill you. Unless they're cooked properly. Okay. Also, they can. Uh, also, their poison can be used against enemies if extracted properly. If you can bring me some of these tasty, tasty, really tasty, uh, tasty mushrooms, I'll extract the poison for you. Sound fair? All right. We need to find three ghost caps, and uh, we'll get ghost slime, because, um, because, uh, yeah, we apparently we want that. Sure, sure game. All right, um, there's a city over there. Could go over there. I vote we go here. We found, uh, we are approached by an old scraggly witch-like figure, hunched over wearing a hood and walking with a large staff. The witch comes right at you. Oh God, avoid. <clears throat> All right, let's gonna go. This is a poverty dungeon. Okay, I should be like investigating the different question marks, probably. I'm gonna go to outpost number two. Out. Oh god, it's a dude with a face. He's level three. He hits pretty hard, but if we kill him. I feel like uh, we'll level up. Alright, choose new skill. Uh, battle cry. Temporarily stun all enemies. Bolster your next attack. Does double damage. Grim aura. Uh, how much magic do we have? Five? Kind of like bolster. Plus six health regeneration. Well, that's not bad. Like, we're going to learn that. Alright, close that. Loot, a broken sword, sure, whatever. Alright, we're, we're... Oh my god, the game's just wanting so much out of me. The game is being extra needy right now. Um, let's see here. We'll give, we'll give Chaos one intelligent point, but we're putting the other points into strength. We should be able to use the ruined armor now, which is a plus one defense over his dirty shirt of nothingness. I think. I, I just feel like it looks it looks better anyway. Um, spear. I think we need level three. Oh, we're going to have to get his agility way up for the spear as well. Oh, wow. Probably not going to be able to use that. You come across another wanderer crossing your path. They look scared. Don't be scared. The wanderer appears to be injured and asks for your help. Oh, I want my stupid potion. The wanderer tells you about a great treasure and marks it on your map. Oh, that cost us a freaking potion. What is this? Alright, there's a village up here that has an inn and a potion shop and stuff. Alright, we're going to head this way. Hopefully we won't die. Oh god, it's a it's a serpent. 
Oh, he hit me for five damage. We're gonna use this chill spell. Gonna regenerate our aura. Oh god, this dude is a beast. Alright, loot. He has a shield on him. Oh, I forgot. Our shield, sh we have 10% blocking with our current shield. This looks like it's the same shield. Exact same shield. So we'll just throw that stuff in there. You come across a wanderer crossing your path. They look curious. The wanderer is holding some treasure and doesn't notice you. Hello? The wanderer says he will sell the mysterious item to you. Uh, we could steal it or buy it. I, I vote we just buy it. Oh, it's a full potion. Let's go. Yes. All right, let's talk advice. If you're overburdened, don't forget you can put items in the storage box at Guild Outposts. You can always receive stored items from any storage box. It's a pro tip. Oh, Lord in heaven, don't kill me. What's my health? I can't see my health. Why are we getting so many beast eyes is what I want to know. Oh, no. We had to use the full potion. Chaos. Got a crit hit. Nice. Jeez. They were trying to kill you, Chaos. Alright, you have a new skill. Uh, we can temporarily stun enemies. I actually kind of want that. I kind of want that. He had a leather helmet. All right, we can use it. We need all the defense we can get. Uh, increase max health, increase magic points, increase attack speed. Increase damage with melee weapons, do two points there. Increase your overall health. All right, potion shop. Um, All right, we need to buy an antidote poison, I think, and a regular potion. All right. Can we... Can I sell things? We have 22 gold left. Double-click items for details. Drop items here to sell them. All right, weapon shop. Let's sell our old broken sword for zero gold. Fantastic. Potion shop. Okay. Let's uh, go to the general store. All right, we'll sell this dirty shirt. Not worth anything. Beast eyes. Sell for one gold each. Terrible. This is an extra shield. We'll sell for four gold. A skull for one gold. Uh, oh god, we have a quest. Okay. <laughs> uh, we could buy another key. Antidote push of attack. Short sword worth eight. Alright, let's look at this short sword. Uh, it'll... It's way better than the broken sword we have. I feel like we have to buy it. Alright, now we do 4 damage every attack. So that's really good. Uh, the broken swords aren't worth crap. Alright, this place doesn't have a guild, though. 
we can heal our two health points for eight gold. Uh, nah. There's a treasure chest back there. That wasn't there earlier. Alright, we're going back. Come across a new house. Uh, the ceiling is sagging in the study and there's a chest. A wooden wand and an orb. Uh, it's an offhand item. So instead of the shield, it would do two damage. It's a plus two damage, uh, but we don't have the strength or the level for it. So it's definitely something we will be selling for treasure. Let's go to the dining area. Oh, this dude's so dead. He didn't do any damage to us. That was just that was just money in the bank. All right. The guild says there's skeletons in our area. The Church of the Ascending has been raising the dead from their own graveyards to protect themselves from the many threats of the land in these trying days. Unfortunately, the animators of the church often lose control of the unearthed and don't clean up their mess. Bring us some skulls intact and we can give them a proper burial. I just sold a skull game. Alright, Chaos is at full health. But he's making his way to this chest. Oh, there's a witch. Bad hair. She tried to shoot an arrow at me. What a jerk. Scroll of poison. That casts poison and inflicts light poison. Alright, so now we have a scroll to use in a mission. And we have us a fancy ring of stamina. Uh, which is going to give us plus two travel distance. And we can see more of the map maybe. Plus two. No, that's more overall health. Alright. Um... We're traveling to the treasure chest. We made it. You come across a large treasure chest. We don't have any keys. I done, I done goofed. I done goofed. I goofed. Oh, one hit this dude. One hit him. Oh, one hit or quitter. Some travel boots? Sure. Oh, one hit this skeleton. One hit him. He gone. Uh, get out of here. Right now we are rolling. We're back in the far west, which is more the newbie area. All right, we're at the initial town you're supposed to go to. Let's turn in your orientation. We have our supply bag. Give you a ring of warding, which gives you uh, more magic power and another max health increase. Now we have a key, some potions, uh, a supply bag for, I guess, us to sell. Um, what did we need to use the spear again? Like a crap ton of agility? Oh, a full potion. I don't have enough money for that. All right. Um, wood wand. Magic shop. We'll sell the orb. We'll keep the scroll of poison. Uh, I'm gonna sell the supplies bag. Is there a general store? Maybe we can just sell it anywhere. That bag was worth eight gold. I wonder if that was a really good bag. I don't know. All right, we've got 34 gold now. We have two potions. Maybe we're good. Should we keep our money? All right, we have a two-two sword. We don't want a one-one dagger. 
A ball mace. We don't have near enough for that. Magic. Crap. No, we don't want any of that. Potion shop. Do we want the full potion? I vote yes. Alright, Chaos. I'm doing my best to get you potions so you don't die, brother. I'm trying to keep you alive. You can fast travel in this game eventually. Sweet. Uh, there is an inn. And we don't have enough money. We're one gold short. Alright, we just got one gold. And a key. And... The hardy ruined armor of health. Alright, let's compare these two armors. Defense, three, but it's got a plus one defense, so it's really four. This one ups our magic, health, and we regenerate faster. I actually think this is better. So, we're gonna change... We're going to change armor. And we're adding a, a house. It's got a library with a bird snake. Got him. All right, check the bookcases. We got us a scroll of healing. How much does it heal? Restores some health. All right, we're just going to use it now. I made a mistake. There's a bedroom here. We could have just magically slept. Oh, I screwed up. That's okay. That's okay. There's a chest here in the dining room area. It's got us another full potion and some slippers. Uh, the slippers have more defense and we have a higher chance of finding items uh, we don't move as quickly but i think with low health you should roll with the slippers and then maybe when we're ever on the run we'll throw the travel boots on nursery nothing in the nursery bedroom might as well get full health while we're here i agree this dude is a beast all right we got full health um, I think we should probably head north to this village. Boom. We didn't take any damage. We are just wrecking people right now. Oh, God, they're jumping us like crazy, but we're just smashing them. Oh, there's a manor up here. Well, sign me up. Oh, freaking skeletons. This game is fun. Oh, science is our first ever level four. Uh, strong attack, a slightly slower attack, which does 150% of the damage of players, max damage and briefly stuns the target. That's not bad. I haven't been using much of the magic with chaos. I haven't been using near, how do I? How do I switch skills? Skills. So at the bottom down here, it's got attack, block, warm aura, battle cry, and escape. How do we get strong attack on our uh, on our quick bar? It's kind of oh, I know. 
Ah. Aha. Okay, now I understand how to change the buttons at the bottom. Oh, we didn't use our points over here. Um... All right, we need to go to the general store and sell that armor. Scroll of poison. Got a lot of little potions right now. We've got two full potions. Okay. I'm feeling really good right now. I wouldn't mind buying another key. Visibility potion? Temporary avoid all battles while traveling. Eh. I'm okay. Scroll of healing, scroll of poison. Oak staff, antidote. None of that's intriguing with our build right now. Let's look at the axe. It is two to four damage. Our current sword is a two-two. But I only have four gold. Uh alright, we need to save up for an axe. We need to quit spending all of our money all the time. I really want to use the spear, but the required agility is just I think it's almost not worth it. So I think I'm gonna sell the spear. It was only worth four gold. I'm a little disappointed with that. I guess we can travel to this village. You can definitely tell the skeletons and things are getting harder. They're dropping us lots of potions this game. Uh, we need four skulls and three ghost caps still. We come across a deserted home. There's a chest. A book of chill. Permanently learn the chill skill. We need eight intelligence. Uh, we'll probably end up selling that. And a hearty shield of stone. Uh, the defense is the same as the one we have now. It has the plus 10% blocking, plus it's got some damage protection, plus more max health. So this new shield is going to be even better. I used some magic that battle just to try to test some things out. Oh, a skull. We need skulls. A bright bone club of lords. Zero to two damage. Plus two intellect. Plus 12% damage to bosses. No, thank you. I mean, I'll take it, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to be like hardcore with it. Another scroll of healing. You know what? I'm going to use this. No, I'm not. There's a paper in the nursery. It's another monolithic research paper. It's got three suns and then a sun without the rays around it. So nobody knows what that means. Put that in there. I'm going to go ahead and use the scroll of healing to get our health all the way up. As we continue to adventure further and further away from cities. A group of thieves, they look dangerous. This is our time to shine. The thieves surround you. There are three of them. This is our time to shine. 
All right, I'm gonna use my spell of poison. Oh, there's another bandit appeared. Oh, this is bad. I think I'm gonna use a potion. All right, next attack should kill him. <sighs> A bandit's tooth, huh? What? I guess that's a quest item. Smoke bomb. Temporarily increase your chance of escape. Do not drink. Okay. Jeez. Alright, let's use a potion. That was... That was hardcore. I don't want to get too far away from home in case I need to go back and heal. We do have a few full potions and we could work our way to that city. Poisoned. Mighty Ring of Doom. And a key. Plus three strength. Let's look at our different rings. Plus two overall health. Plus one. I think we should get rid of the Ring of Warding. I think the, the Ring of Doom is going to be what we want. Now how will the, will the poison ever go away? A bone club. Garbage. I mean, I have an antidote, but I just was wondering if uh There's another wanderer on your path. He's sitting on a rock. They look harmless. All right, first let's use the antidote. The wanderer greets you. Later, Cookie. The wanderer wonders what you'd like to discuss. The shadow is coming. That is not helpful. Another bright bone club of fury. It's just not good enough compared to a sword. I'm sorry. You come across an enchanted healing fountain. Yes. Yes. Hey, what up, cat? Alright, what happens if we drop one gold in there? All right, there's some big things on the horizon here. Let's go. Let's go here, I guess. This is a manor. It has a potion shop and a guild shop. Let's just go. All right, we made it to the manor and I'm going to buy another antidote. Oh, 
God, we need our monies though for other things. Oh no. Alright. There's a guild outpost here. Oh, there's a map. Oh. oh look at that that's the map of the world all right i want that do we need to throw anything in the storage let's put the monolithic papers in there Trying to uh, get everything organized. All right. Oh, no, I wanted to store the skulls in there. Those are quest items. And really the bandit's tooth. Maybe we should store those in there. Uh, let's sell the bone clubs. Let's... Let's see if the potion shop will give us any kind of decent. Uh oh, I lost my purse. How do I reopen that? Uh oh, spaghettios. Alright, I want to sell the wicked shield. It's worth 10 gold. Six. Alright, here we go. This this store is giving us some dollars. Okay. Oh, this is the first window that I can adjust. A lot of the windows you can't adjust. Aw, oh, dang, girl. Aw, oh, dang. All right, so now I might be able to click things a little easier. All right, trying to fit things to the screen the best I can. Sweet, look at that, all right. Let's go back. This is a cave in the mountains. I don't know if I want to. Uh, I don't know if I want to go there. What is this? It's a dungeon. I just. I'm not. Pa I'm not super powerful yet, you know? Alright, we have our first ever level 5. Um, we can upgrade these skills. So we can stun enemies for longer. All about that life. All about that. Okay. He gave us a skull. I think we only need one or two more skulls. Acquire a strength of seven, which we have. This is seven defense. That is a lot of defense. Uh, takes a little bit away from some of our magic abilities, but I think it's worth it. So. All right. Um. We did level up, so let's put one strength into that, one strength into that. All right. Oh, there's a meter if you're evil or good. I didn't understand what this meter meant earlier. 
But now I get it. It has to do with if you're neutral, good, or evil. Okay. All right. Living seeds. I don't know what those do, but I'll take them. A hooded figure crossing your path. They look scared. The hooded figure is being attacked and it's losing. Let's go help them. Nothing on him. All right, let's talk to him. The hooded figure tells you about a great treasure and marks it on our map. Oh, that's not far at all. Not far at all. You come across a treasure chest. We're going to open it. It's got a potion of attack. A horned warp. Uh, it's two defense plus 15% damage to humans. How does that compare to our current helmet? It's one less, one less defense. And plus 15% when you're only doing like three damage is like marginal. So I'm actually not going to wear that even though it looks super cool. And then we can't use staffs because we're not that we're not that kind of creature. Uh, oh, there's there's some of these monoliths. Oh, all right, we're headed to an outpost. Oh, we hit a snake. All right, we killed him before he even hit us. That's a pretty good run. Oh, a phantom. Oh, we just ran out of magic. He has a spirit mask. We can wear it on our head. Where is... Five defense. Well, that's clearly better. All right, we are we're wearing a spirit mask now. Okay. All right, we come across a wanderer on a path sitting on a rock. They look harmless. The wanderer greets you. He sees your leather helm, and they offer to buy it for seven gold. Sure. Wander takes the item and gives you gold. Uh, let's talk rumors. I heard stories of strange altars in the dungeons below the graveyard. Some say there's a source of great power, but be careful associating with forbidden magic. You're not my dad. You can't tell me what to do. Ah, I'm just trying to think what would be, what would be smart. It's 9-11 in the game. You see a dark monolith. The ground is raised as if the monolith, monolith was pushed out from below the surface. The monolith towers above you, absorbing all sound in the area. Make offering? Uh... I don't know what to offer it. Okay. That's weird. I think we need to work our way to this southern city. Well, it doesn't have... Oh, it does have an inn. And so then we can heal and we can uh, we can work on a dungeon. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to head south. Come across a deserted home. Let's explore the attic. Oh, there was a bad guy. We crushed him. He didn't have anything on him, though. 
There, there's a chest down here in the storeroom. It's got a mighty nail club of haunting. Alright, it does the same max damage as our current sword, but it starts slower. It's got two, a plus two strength though. I actually think I'm going to try it out. These boots are pretty good. They don't find magical items like my slippers, but they have plus two defense, so. We got red boots on. We have a magic mask. We have a club with a nail in it. We're intimidating right now. I would say we are very intimidating. Critical one hit this that phantom holy crap. We just one hit Okay, so this game is About saving the world um, It changes every time you play it if you die it's game over and you start completely over uh, I think you want to get to this thing over here and be a boss and prove yourself worthy to be the savior of the world. Uh, but it's a fantasy based game. So it's just like a... You know, it's, it's just a fantasy based game. So far it's pretty fun though. Oh, we found an enchanting pond. Now I don't even need to go to the city. Alright, we're going to the dungeon. Oh, this, is, this could be really good or really bad. keep wasting my magic oh yeah here we go dungeon Come across that locked treasure chest. We're going to unlock it. A short sword. Uh, that's basically the one we used to have. Oh no! Mistakes were made. We should have gone to the, the town to sell things. We can't... I can't even pick this stuff up right now. Eight defense? How much does this one have? Seven? Alright, we need to leave the dungeon ASAP. Oh no! Oh, we, we wrecked that skeleton. He had a scroll of poison? Nice. There's a strange figure on your path. It is carrying a small bag overflowing with shiny objects. The various very folks investigating. No. We don't have time. Oh crap. There's a battle. A kite shield. Eight defense plus fifteen percent blocking. That's way better than the shield we have. Way better. All right, new shield hype. Too bad we can't carry our old one to a store. Oh, 
Oh, I almost didn't hit, click that fireball spell in time. Return to surface. Yes. All right. Take me to this town. Let's go. Ooh, a key. Okay. We have made our way back to civilization. All right, let's sell these slippers and these old boots. Uh, the shield. Hardy armor. This stupid helmet. Should I be selling weapons at a weapon store? Okay, so it's worth 10 here. I want to see if it's worth 10 at the weapon store. Yeah, everything's worth the same amount. Okay, um... A war axe, huh? Does 4 to 7 damage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we have to buy that. That thing is sick. Or we could look at the long sword. Oh, that's only three to four. All right, war axe. We're buying it. You can't use this item yet? Why? What did I read wrong? Oh, we're one strength short? No way. No way. Learn how to read, Hein. small bag I think you can have the bags inside of bags I think all right we got full health uh, do we want to go back to the dungeon there's also a chest back there going back I'm going back I forgot to put that skull in my storage box at the guild crap oh god we we hit a big dude I'm trying to remember what this uh, smoke bomb does. Okay, it's for escaping. Okay, there's a boss coming up. There's there's a boss fight coming up, but I don't like our health right now. That's I think that's my biggest problem. Radiant treasure though. Oh. We're not doing much damage because we don't have a weapon equipped. We actually don't even have a, a weapon equipped right now. Oops. What did I just do? What happened to the chest? That was over here earlier.
Oh, this could get messy. I just had to use a potion. Hopefully this battle will level us up. Oh, thank you, Jesus. All right, now. Plus two agility. Plus three strength. Now that rings garbage. Okay, no. I feel confident enough to fight the boss now. We've got an axe actually equipped. So, game on. Oh, it's on, dude. It is so on. It is so on like Donkey Kong. I just did 19 damage right there. Scroll of healing. Full potion of magic. Oh, it's boss time. Oh, it is boss time. Let's go, baby. Okay, it's not boss time. A cruel priest mask of purity. Uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. They're really... I'm really getting on my nerves right now. Oh, don't you throw fireballs at me? All right, I think that's the last skull we need for a uh, a limp circlet of intellect. Nope. All right, we're going to use our, gosh, we're getting jumped hardcore just on the way to the boss. All right, here it goes, here it goes, here it goes. Use strong attack. A skeleton appears. I think we got this though. I think we got this. Yes! Oh, we did it! Oh my gosh. The game was throwing all kinds of stuff at us. Holy crap. Look at all of this. Uh, magical item. Bell of the Dead. It's a charm. More battle experience but attracts undead. How about no? Bag is too full. Son of a bitch. Uh, Feather of Transform. Uh, I don't trust it. How heavy are these skulls? I don't think we need this third one. Alright, seven defense and three intellect. This one's eight and no intellect. 
I'm not really much on intelligence normally, but I'll take it. We need a bigger bag. Oh, oh, can we glitch the game? Can we keep this window open and still and still loot in a little bit? Oh, banana. Banana Slugfest! Thank you for joining the subscribers. Um, I didn't really talk about it last night too much when Candy subscribed, but there are going to be some other bonuses, uh, custom emotes, and things like that. Uh, I need to work on it. If anybody wants to make me uh, a custom emote, that'd be awesome. Uh, but... Uh, I don't think you have to watch ads anymore, but I could be wrong. Um, get you a custom emote. Get you into the sub Sunday elites. Uh, clearly subscribers will get uh, precedence over normal followers, things like that. Uh, and really it just shows a lot of love and support to the channel. I thank you so much, Banana, and all the rest of the subscribers. You guys are the real MVPs. Now, I'm trying to see if I can loot. Uh, I think that box went away. Okay. Let's. Oh, there's no guild here. There's no guild here. That's the problem. And that shield was five pounds. At your Cortana spotlight. Oh my god. Uh, Cortana, are you serious? Oh my lord. I just got thrown out of the game. Alright, give me one minute. I'm fixing this. I'm fixing this. Alright, I'm back. Bell of the Dead. I'm going to use this Feather of Transform. You feel faintly connected to the cosmos. Nobody knows what that means. Deft Orb of... Uh, Death Orb of Health uh, is going to require way too much intellect. <coughs> Excuse me. So... Put that there. Alright, we've got 116 gold. 116 gold. Um, recently, we bought an axe, but it looks like the game is scaling the shops as we level. So there's already new things here. Um, this axe is just way too strong it's just way too strong mace of doom is garbage don't want that everything is garbage compared to that war axe that war axe is beast all right potions nothing there it really tickles my my fancy All right, a small bag is forty-five dollars. So I think what I can do is I can 
I can put things in the bag that uh, actually take down my weight from my normal bag. What up, dude? We'll put the antidote in there. Let's put the map in there. All right. Okay. Dude, I love this game. L U V. All right, let's look at the shoes that we currently have. Hmm. I think the magic boots are better, but just barely because they're actually less defense and a little less travel distance, but we're going to make it work. Hey, buy my boots. Easy, I think you've created a monster here. I'm having a ton of fun. This is my third playthrough. Uh, I played once under my name, and then with our buddy Cookie, that's like never here, came by. Uh, so we're, we named this character after Science of Chaos, and we're doing well. We're taking it nice and slow. Uh, he's a warrior. I played as a mage. Um... Then Cookie was a beast kin. Uh, you'll be interested in a unique product we make specific adventures. You won't find this potion anywhere else. All we ask is for you to gather the core ingredient. We'll do the rest. It's that simple. Three living seeds. I had some living seeds. I don't know where they're at. Um, I need to make it down there, but I almost want to backtrack. Like it's. I'm in a pickle. I almost want to go back into this dungeon. I feel like I didn't loot everything. I think there was a radiant treasure chest still in here. Get off me. Hey, 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 what happened? So easy, have you beaten the game yet? On, on one of your runs? Oh, is that what minimized the window was a phantom? What a jerk. Is that what happened? You come across a radiant treasure chest. Oh my. Oh, a new shirt. Uh, that shirt's kind of garbage. This chest is actually kind of poo poo. But I mean, I guess we can sell the stuff. I mean, I guess we'll grab it. I guess this is just money in the bank right now. Oh yeah, selling super easy. Did you did you miss me doing that a minute ago? I'll show you, dude. I will show you, my friend. I kill this priest. A hearty ring and a full potion. Can't even have the potion. All right, let's see here. Use that. Oh yeah, you can totally sell stuff. You have to drag it to the the bottom left hand corner of the the shop. Alright, I think this ring is going to be better than the other ring that we have. So we're going to switch rings. And we'll put the ring in this chest. Okay. 
I think we're about to level up again. I think we're gonna level up. Oh, just got a critical hit. A long cleaver. Five to seven damage. That's actually, believe it or not, better than what I have. Oh, but it's two levels away. Oh, and it's so heavy. It's so heavy. Yo, what up, Ace? Seven pounds. I'm still five pounds short. Sucking it up. I'm sucking it up. What happened yesterday? We actually missed you, man. We got two new subscribers, Banana and Candy. Dude, everybody's getting in on this the chat badges. God. All right, I'm going to go with Battle Cry 3 because I really like stunning them. He had a scroll of poison. Okay. Um That last weapon wanted strength of 18. Even though we're still a full level short. Oh, you went to the water park? That's awesome. Yeah, this game is really clever. I don't understand why more people aren't playing this game. This game's amazing. Oh, it's about to be, I guess, morning in the game or nighttime. It says 5.15, but it looks like it's getting dark. Okay. Time to sell some stuff. All right, easy. Watch and learn. And all the stores sell for the same amount of time. That's not right. It's your time limit. Oh, there's a time limit? Oh, shisa. Keys, skulls. Scrolls need to be level eight. Yeah, double click items for details, drop items here to sell them. Yeah, it says drop items here to sell them. <laughs> I bet you feel like a goob. Welcome to my life. Full potion for 25. Oh, I need to sell this weapon. Uh, long cleaver plus one. I really want to use that. 
All right, one more level. Uh, oh, we need to get going, game. The shadow is coming. Oh, sea serpent. Hardy Ring of Frenzy. Plus three vitality. Plus two critical chance. No, I don't think we're going to use it this build. You come across a house. It's got a study. Let's unlock the chest. It's got an orb. And a way crystal. Now the way crystals get you outside quickly. There's a dead dude in the kitchen. Get out of the kitchen. He had a short sword. I mean, we'll take it, but we'll probably end up dropping him before we get back to a town. That's kind of crappy at this point in the game. All right, let's rest in the bed. Hopefully. That didn't hurt the shadow too much. And we are, we are on... Like, it, urgent help. Oh, God. Getting attacked by a beast. All right. Oh, stop it. All these beasts? A beast eye. I feel like I need that for a quest or something. All right, let's look at the messages down here. Urgent help requested. Hello, my name is Goku. I'm from Dragon Ball Z. I'm just kidding. My name is Gilu, and I'm hoping you can help me. I was attacked by some bandits recently, and they took a very special ring from me. It's been in my family for several cataclysms, and I'd hate to lose it now of all times. Please, if you find it, can you drop it off at a guild outpost? I'll make sure you get a reward. Yeah, yeah, no problem. All right, we have an outpost or an outpost. I vote this outpost. There's another wandering crossing your path. They look scared. Hey, don't be scared. The wanderer appears to be injured and asks for your help. Give potion. I don't have any small potions, man. Sorry. Not to be a jerk. Looks like there's some cities. Oh, we're close to this city on the map. All right. Let's get hyped for that. Oh, this guy's angry. Oh, he had a key. I love keys. Uh, have you done anything with the mono monoliths, Easy? Abandoned house. There's a nursery. Stupid skeleton. Let's see if nothing in the attic. Nothing in the kitchen. Sometimes there's stuff in the study. A book of wand mystery. Do more damage with wands. Sure. Book of Burn. Permanently learn the skill Burn. Sure. Okay. I respect that. I respect you not giving me a spoiler. This is a dark monolith. The ground is raised as if the monolith was pushed out from below the surface. And it wants an offering. I, I just don't know what to offer it. That's the problem. Oh, this, this lady. This lady is a tramp. Got her. All right, we got a skull.
All right, these spears were good early in the game, but they're garbage now. All right, Deft Ring of Doom. Plus four agility, more damage to beasts. This one's a strength. I'm definitely more of a strength guy. This one's overall health. I think I'm more overall a health guy, so I'm not going to use this ring, but I'm going to take it and sell it. The spear will fit in my backup bag. Alright. We're almost at the city. Oh no, level 8 skeleton? Alright, should I poison him? Yeah, he looks really tough. He's hurting me. Oh, that was a tough battle. Really tough battle. Down to eight health. How close are we to the fort? We have eight health. I really don't want to use a full potion. Really don't want to use. You know what? We'll use a small potion. I need the small potions for quests, though. <sighs> Fudge. All right, this shield needs level eight. But it's a way better shield. Okay. Alright, so I have to take this shield. Once again, I'm going to have to shuffle inventory. I cannot wait to get level 8. I didn't know you could use all caps lock. Poor Candy just lost a thousand gold. Alright, how much does this shield weigh? Six pounds, seven ounces. All right, we got to come up with six pounds. Okay, let's sell some things. Alright, quests. Skeletons in your area. That actually leveled us up. Alright, now that we're level 8, that changes a lot of things. Alright. Changes a lot of things. We can now use the new shield and we can use our new cleaver. Right, the traveling is uh, not bad. I'm going to keep it. I'm not going to sell it, but I'm not going to use it right now. Alright, let's go to the... Uh, 
potion shop and sell some things. All right, we're doing okay. Oh, I thought the kitties were gone. Well, I'm glad that they're kind of there, that you can kind of love on them. Kind of. Crescent potion, what does this do? Grains, one stat point. I don't think that's worth it. Armor shop. Nothing in there is really tickling my fancy. Bright Ring of Wrath. Now, are we? We have fast travel places now, but it's it's a red star, which I don't know what that means, but it probably isn't good. All right, there's uh, looks like there's a couple towns just right outside here. Just gonna keep traveling, I guess. Oh, there's a giant jellyfish. Oh, there's another jellyfish. Oh no! All right, one down. All right. Jeez, those jellyfish—they come out of nowhere. But they give they give us potions. O M G a level eight beast. He hit me pretty hard. Oh, what? There's some different swords here. Different swords here. Strength required 24. Damage is 5 to 9. Plus 1 stun on attack is actually really good. I'm not gonna buy it, but that's pretty good. The saw sword is seven to nine. I have to buy that one though. I have to buy that. Only got nine dollars back. But that's okay. It's okay. All right, so we now have a saw sword, which uh, you know anything means that's awesome. Invisibility potion, meh. Guild. Uh, we can throw the beast's eye in there, I guess. All right, quests, ring, living seeds. And ghost caps. Uh, we are going to stay the night, though. New quest. Protect yourself from bandits. With the arrival of so many inexperienced adventurers these days, we've seen uh, some troublesome opportunities taking advantage of the situation. These bandits operate in groups and prey on those carrying anything valuable. It's been too much for the region's guards to deal with them on their own, so they are asking for our help. If you dispose of some of these thieves and bring us some proof, there's a reward in it for you. We need four bandit teeth. We already have two, believe it or not. Believe it or not, we already have two. So, let's go, let's go. Um, hopefully, we won't venture too far and get wrecked or something
So easy. I don't know if you answered uh, my question earlier, and I definitely missed your message on the monolith notes. Uh, I looked at them, but I didn't understand. We can look at them together if you want to help me figure out the puzzle. Uh, but did you beat the game yet? The Wanderer says he will sell you a mysterious item for $31. How about no? What is this? It's a beacon? What's the beacon do? You stand before one of three guardian beacons. The ground is littered with the corpses of other outsiders. There is an inscription at the base of the beacon. Read warning. The inscription says, light three beacons to open the path of the king. This beacon is guarded by Margul. Oh no. This is either going to be really bad or really, really good. You got to the last castle. Oh. How? How? Do I have to light all the beacons every time? I'm nervous about this, but we're doing it, team. We're fighting a dude. Oh, he's got like 800 health. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm so sorry, Chaos. time smoke bomb run away you can't escape I didn't mean to block stop blocking no 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 oh no oh silence the wander level 8 warrior he was he was so young. Oh. Oh no. Level eight though, definitely a new record. Yeah, we always had IBMs at home, I believe Candy. We had old IBMs at, at home, but they were MS DOS prompt. Big O B drives. Spin gems to permanently unlock gifts, new appearances, settings, and hockeys. Collect gems by leveling up characters, higher levels, earn more gems. Are these starting gifts? Yes, they are. Heineman, read. Ring of Pain. It that doesn't sound smart. Book of skill? It doesn't, it doesn't want to tell me what that means. Oh, should we get a new fancy cursor? I vote no. Uh, I don't really feel like I need any of the hotkeys. Starting gifts are where it's at. My first game system was the 64. Mom wasn't big on uh, game systems. But uh, I, the first game system I ever played, I think, oh, was at our babysitter. Christy Earhart's house was the NES. A master key? What's a master key? Lucky coin. Alright, we're going to start with... 
a shield and dagger. We've got 20 gems left. I think we're going to just hold on to them. All right, we're going to play one more game tonight. Hopefully it won't go too fast. Hopefully it will take up the, the hour that we have left. Okay, this looks more like a female character. So we're going to name this one. We're going to name this one after Candy. All right, Candy. Candy, what class would you like to be? Warrior, adventurer, mage, rogue, or beast skin? Uh, adventurer is a well rounded character, is not great at anything, not bad at anything. A warrior is a strong character. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, we'll do candy. She subbed last night. I was going to do it for banana, but we'll do banana next. Um, a well-rounded character, not great at anything, not bad. Warriors are a strong character, skilled with heavy weapons and armor. Mages are wise characters, focused on magic and light armor. Rogues are agile, master of many battle skills. And the Beastkins are an odd character, strong and tough, but has a bad rep. So candy... Which one do you want to do? I haven't played Rogue yet. If I don't hear from her soon, we're probably going to go Rogue. Probably gonna go rogue. All right, everyone gets the same world generated once per day with leaderboards. Okay. We'll do our daily leaderboard run. Uh, yeah, I I guess I'm gonna pick rogue for her. All right, let's accept. All right, starting gift. Dagger or shield? I'm gonna go dagger because she's a rogue. All right, we need to go to our orientation. Put our log down here. Status, I think, is here. This here. Yeah, this game is actually really fun, dude. Really fun. How good is this dagger? Not great. I would say that was probably not worth buying. Alright, we see a wanderer in the distance. Let's approach him. Uh, he wants our potion. Uh, sure. We're nice people. Our reputation increased slightly. Um, he tells us about a great treasure and marks it on our map. Oh, 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 I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready. All right, he gave us a key and a potion. That's actually a really good drop. Oh no! Oh, it was a fake treasure chest! It was a troll! You still like playing Might and Magic? Nice. Alright. Leather. Alright. Uh, Book of Healing. Permanently learn the skill heal. Well... 
Can't put it. We can't use that. I don't think the dirty shirt's worth anything. I'm just gonna throw it away. All right, let's go to this town. Let's travel it up. Oh, skelly town. Easy, do you ever uh, block? All right. All right, we have leveled up. Let's see here. As a rogue, we can dodge. This is a passive skill. I love passive skills. Uh, we can poison people. Open locks without the use of a key. Bandage. Crit. I might actually like dodge. I think I like dodge. Wait, 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 wait. I don't have a map this time. Why don't I have a map this time? Oh, bummer. Well, that's weak. I already have 47 gold, but I don't think we want to waste any of our gold in the first store. As I say that, there's a spear here. Oh man, we're not even close to that level. You just told? That's funny. Great minds think alike around here. Was I going to sell anything? This requires level 3 and 7 strength. Well then we better get... Uh... Better get our strength up. If we're going to wear that. Um... Alright. Where do we want to go next? Hey, I wish I had a world map this time around. I don't understand why I gave me a world map last time and now it's not. That's just selfish, really. Alright, we found a hooded figure across our path. He's holding some treasure and he doesn't not talk to us. So let's talk to him. He's only selling it for 7 gold. I'll buy it for 7. Grim Robe of Agility. I guarantee that is a nice item. Requires level 3. Um, doesn't do as much damage to the undead creatures, but it's pretty good. Uh, let's talk rumors. Have you heard of the Foundation? They say in the mountains summoning demons, but why? Demons are so dangerous, they must be planning something. So there is a mission, apparently, um, with people selling demon stuff. That's right, Candy. You're a rogue. There's some bandits. They look dangerous. Um, let's talk to them. The bandits say you can pass if you pay the toll. Oh, heck no. I'll fight every last one of you with my eyes closed. Alright, one down. Oh, no. Alright, one down. Critical hit. Oh, he's trying to throw a bomb at me. Oh, uh, I kind of like the blocking now. I'm going to start blocking more. 
He defeated the bandits and finds some treasure they were hiding. Crescent potions uh, add one stat point, so you might as well immediately use them. And then a leather helmet. Sweet. This guy has a mighty ring and an antidote if we get poisoned. And then this last dude. Oh, we got us a rogue costume now. Once we level up, we're going to look super cool. All right. And then a deft ring of vitality. So plus one agility, plus one vitality. Uh, this is plus one intellect, which, eh. And that's plus one strength. I think we'll get rid of this ring. All right, so we've got um, a village to the north. It's got an inn, and uh, our health is down a little bit, so we're probably going to head to the head to this, and we can probably put some things in storage, like the skull and the bandit's teeth. Ooh, jellyfish! Should have blocked. I can't. Oh, too late. Freaking jellyfish. Alright, here at the guild, let's store the bandit's teeth and the skulls. Those are normally quest items. Now, let's sell this robe of agility, I think. No, no, no. Maybe? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. We'll sell it. We'll just sell it. This needs level 3. We're almost level 3. Oh, but what's better? The thief garb? Or the leather? The leather is actually better. I mean, how often are we trying to escape? And is 12% really that good? It's really not. It's really not. Um, what do we need to be keeping in our supply bag? Book of Healing. We need five intellect. It's only one more. Bright Ring of Flight, sell that garbage. Oh, watch this, watch this, watch this. All right, we have learned the skill heal. So now we can heal, I think. All right. Deft Acts of Judgment requires a lot of strength, but I don't mind that. Plus 15% damage to demons. This kind of sounds hot. I can't help it. I just want to beat things with axes. Skeletons in your area. The Church of the Ascending has been raising the dead from graveyards. We need four skulls for a quest. And how many do we have in storage? One. Okay. Hooded figure is approaching us. He looks harmless. We're going to talk to him. He figures he, uh, he wants to talk. Let's talk rumors. I've heard stories of strange altars and dungeons below the graveyard. Some say they are a source of great power. But be careful associating with forbidden magic. Hey, you're not my dad. You can't tell me what to do.
Level two. All right, we leveled up. Um, I'm gonna upgrade our healing spell. Excuse me one second, Mr. Battle. Um, you can't use this item yet. I think I need eight strength. Required strength nine. Okay. So we have that, and because we're a rogue, we need to be fighting fast. Heine Borden. I don't know what that means. Maybe we can use this leather now. All right, so we need to sell our dagger and travel shirt. You are approached by an old scraggly witch-like figure, hunched over wearing a hood and walking with a large staff. The witch comes right up to you. Hello, witch. The witch looks you up and down and says, I can help you with your adventure if you're interested. Yeah, sure. You can just barely see a small beneath the hood. Your first one is free. The witch's staff begins to shake and there's a flash of light. The witch is gone. You feel a change in yourself. Health regeneration permanently increased. Hey, the witch was nice. Who would have known that witches were nice? Not me. Alright, we're going to sell our dagger and our travel shirt. We still have three keys. All right, let's start heading south. I don't know who Lizzie Borden is. I must be dumb. Do I need to Google Lizzie Burden after the stream? Because I will. I'll do it. Oh, found a skeleton. I feel like my attack speed's... Not as fast as it should be. We've come across an abandoned house. The dining room, it's got a library with a skeleton in it. Oh, it's got books. Scroll of healing, I'll take it. Nothing in the storeroom. There's a chest in here. Crescent potion and a crappy staff. Lizzie Borden took an axe and gave her father, father 40 wax, and when she saw what she had done, she gave her mother 41. What? What? I don't know anything about what you guys are talking about. Okay. Um, I want my attacks to be faster. The guild keeps sending me messages over here. Hello, Candy. Making your way to the castle? To help you, we've put a map of the island in your storage box at the guild. Oh, so I guess it just takes time for them to send you the map every time. Are you strong enough? Uh, members who can help cure the unwanted undead will be rewarded. Make sure to come prepared as it will be dangerous. Kill skeletons at this location. We'll get a sweet helmet. It's a star in our world navigator, which is right over here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, I was trying to block. I missed. I missed. 
This guy's being a jerk. Oh, he's throwing a poison. Oh, we're poisoned! Oh, what a jerk. Alright, um... Okay. Uh, we need to heal the an use our antidote. Okay, good. What is this? This is a cave. Uh, for Yang cave. Do we want to check the cave out? <sighs> It might be kind of dangerous, but there's also a star over here. I am a little jealous. I am a little jealous, Candy. Alright, we found an abandoned house. Dining room. It's got a paper with some strange symbols on it. Alright, it's one of the monolithic papers. It's got three sons and then one without a son. I have no idea what that means. I had this before. So if Easy comes back, maybe we can ask him about it. A Grim Spear of the Leech. It doesn't do as much damage as the undead, but it steals some life from time to time. The percentages are so low, and the attack numbers are so low, that it's just almost not worth it. We just learned healing version 3. Ooh, it's a skeleton. All right, we're headed to the the quest, and we've got a ton of items on us that we probably don't even need. But uh, you know, whatever. Let's do this, as the cool kids say. Let's do this. Another skeleton. I don't think I blocked it in time. I was getting better at the blocks earlier, but I don't think I am right now. Oh, we just leveled up! Um. There's a lock picking skill, but uh, we still have. Uh, we still have we still have some keys so I'm not worried about that speaking of keys there's just another key Alright, that's the last skull we need. Alright, let's check out this leather. It's defense of 7. And the one we have is 7. Uh, I mean, I'll take it for now, but I bet I end up throwing it on the ground. Alright, you've arrived at the location of the quest. Are we strong enough? I mean, we're about to find out. 
You see five skeletons just ahead of you. They haven't noticed you. Uh, surprise attack or approach? I'm going to go with attack. All right, one down. Two down. We did it. A mighty club of doom. Oh crap, I clicked the wrong button on one of them. Hopefully he didn't have anything good. You see the skeletons were guarding the entrance to a small tomb. It looks to be the source of skeleton troubles in the area. Alright, let's look at this club real quick. It's garbage. Um, let's enter the tomb. We can hear the rattling of bones nearby. Oh, we found a dungeon. <sighs> Boss is straight ahead. So this is going to be really good or really bad. Oh, I'm cursed. That was close. Oh, that was so close. That was ridiculous. The tomb has been cleansed. A strange stone. I'm now immune to curses. The bag is too full for the cleaver. Hmm. How heavy is that cleaver? Seven pounds, they say. Seven pounds. Okay, so the supplies bag is full. I need to come up with 2.3 pounds. Uh, I'll throw the staff away. And I guess this. Okay. 
And that battle was that battle was freaking hard. A book of clairvoyance. We need seven intelligence. We now have seven intelligence. Potion of attack. Nail club. You can put supply bags on the desktop. Really? Okay. So I don't have to put it in my bag. Well, I kind of like it here. It doesn't change the weight of my bag, but that's that's still a good call. It's still a really good call. By the way, this thing, even though it's bigger, doesn't seem to go past that point. We need to get that, uh, we need to get that map from the guild. What well, I want to come back to that. What up, Finn? Maybe I should put it there. No, I, I like it there. All right, I'm going to head here to sell some stuff and turn turn some stuff in. But I'm kind of curious about this bush. Now I bet this is faster. What is that? Stone arch. Huh. All right, we're headed here. Got to get get her oh crap a lady get out of here lady oh come on double poisoned she's she was a real piece of work All right, if I go to sleep, will the poison go away? All right, guild, storage, map. Okay. Excellent. This is how I had it earlier. Okay. Leveling up did not cure the poison effect. That's disappointing. I'm going to upgrade dodge. Alright, we've done all of the quests available. That's actually pretty sweet. Alright, let's look at our new helmet here. Uh, it's way better in every single way possible. It's a great, great helmet. And uh, we'll sell everything out of the supplies bag here in a minute. Anything else down here? Ruined armor. 
I said earlier, I don't think you get any more for selling things in different spots, but uh, might as well look. 18 strength's not going to happen. I'm going to sell this. And then this I felt like was kind of weak. I didn't like how that took things away from me. These are some crappy staffs. Alright, Traveler's Rings compared to these other rings that we have. Alright, Mighty Ring is a plus one strength. This one's got a, basically a plus two. The Traveler's Ring might be better than the Mighty Ring. So I think we're going to roll Traveler's Ring over Mighty Ring. But if we're in dungeons, we could throw the Mighty Ring on. So I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. I think that would be the wisest move. We don't have any boots. Plus one defense. Alright, I'm going to buy these boots. I'm probably going to get boots next in a quest. I think I'm going to buy the... covers 50% of your magic. I think I'm going to buy this. So we can get our magic back for healing. Alright, I'm going to see if sleeping will cure my poison. We'll see. Are you kidding me? Man, we need... We need some things. Protect yourself from bandits. We need four bandit dudes. <laughs> So we are poisoned and cursed right now. It's kind of a bummer. Uh, all right, Easy told me a minute ago You have to light all three beacons. Okay. Oh, that was weird. All right, so there's a beacon over here. All right, where are we on the map? We're we're here. We missed a beacon down here. We actually need to go back to the left. What up, witch lady? I'm poisoned again. Don't worry. I wasn't ever unpoisoned game, so I don't care. Oh, this freaking lady is going to wear me out. I need an antidote. Real bad. Should I just go right back to the, the city and see if the RNG will have an antidote now? What is that blue stuff? Just like a lake? Yeah, I think that's a lake. Oh no. This dude looks like a jerk. I'm going to heal 
myself. All right, we leveled up. At three poison to next attack. Pick locks, bandage. I might need to get a bandage skill. Ooh, final blow. If the enemy has less than 16 health, kill them. I kind of want to learn that. Cult mask and a silver wand. Mm, I don't think that's near as good as the guild helmet. I'm almost wondering if the guild helmet's going to be the best that I'm going to get. Don't know for sure. Come across a wanderer on a rock. He's being attacked and losing. Oh, we better go help him. Oh, what is that? A corpse eater? That's just nasty. Book of Burn. Uh, I have enough intelligence to learn it, so sure. A buckler. Six defense compared to... It's exactly the same as the one I have. So we'll, we'll take it and then we'll sell it. The Wanderer wonders what you'd like to discuss. Is it better to talk rumors or advice? I feel like right now I need some advice. You'll be able to avoid traps easier if your agility is high. Okay. An imp! Uh, we need an antidote in the worst way. Oh, it's guarded by a dude. I gotta try it though. Oh, he's angry. He's angry. God, he's kicking my ass. I might pull this off. No! I thought I could heal again! Oh, I thought I had one more heal! Oh, it should gray it out if I can't heal. Oh. No! No, I was so close. Global leaderboard was second in the world, though. Second in the world. It looks like one dude actually beat it. 
Hey, if he wants to be a widow, he can be a widow. Normally, he would be a widower, but, you know, maybe after you're dead, he'll identify it differently. You know, we're not here to judge. We're not here to judge. All right. Um, this guy was worthless. He didn't even have a class, apparently. I didn't even know you could pick a class called worthless. Uh, but uh, we got second in the world. Um, all time is a bunch of unknown people. I don't even know what that means. Monthly. Interesting. Interesting. Well, how many gyms do we have? 41 gyms. It's just... It's just Jim, 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 Drew. Well, I wish I could have seen this earlier. Well, team, that was a fun night of streaming. It was a good time. Appreciate everybody for coming by. Um, big shout out to our newest sub, Banana Slugfest. Um, I, I'm not super surprised we didn't have anybody new come in. Uh, this game, for whatever reason, on Twitch is not super popular right now, which is a which is a shame. Um, we're streaming this, and then one other one other guy is streaming it. He's got only three viewers, so um, probably probably. We'll only stream this from time to time, maybe like a like a late night weekend, like a late night weekend game. You know, maybe after we stream something else. I definitely want to revisit this. This game's a blast, and uh, you know, we'll see if uh, see if anything happens. But uh, probably find a different game category with a little bit more people watching maybe get back into a little bit of shadows of mordor uh we also got another game called colony survivor recently or no maybe i just looked at it we'll find us a game i want to find a game that we can do like a good series on uh i need to find some people to do don't starve together which is a fun game and uh definitely people still are interested and want to watch so I need to find some good people to play. Don't start together with. If you're interested in that, send me a DM, which means down low. No, it means direct message. Send me a DM on like Discord or something. We can we can do some don't start together. Uh, and uh, what else? We'll figure out some games to play. We'll figure out some games. But uh, guys, thanks for watching. It's been great. Tragic. Sorry you're coming in late, but I love your face. And guys, if you can't be good, be great. This is Heinemann signing out.